Hey, what is going on guys? Clickwood here back again bringing you guys another Madden 16 Ultimate Team video. Guys, earlier today I reported on a story where I actually had some breaking information regarding Mike Vick, Ultimate Legend, and guys, we finally have the confirmation. All of the things that you're about to see are from the EA blog, but I wanted to make a quick video about it so that we could kind of discuss these things and I could, you know, of course, boast a little bit about being right. No, I'm just joking, but uh, <laughs> we we do uh, want to discuss these things a little bit so that you guys can see some differences that we have in this year's game versus last year's game. So, uh, very first thing, obviously, you're seeing the Ultimate Legend Edition of Mike Vick. Now, this is the boss edition, as I understand it. This is the one that is going to be in packs, just like last year. There's a boss edition of this card. So, the attributes that you see on there, 98 speed, ridiculous, of course. 100 throw power, ridiculous. 97 throw accuracy short, 92 throw accuracy mid, 98 throw accuracy deep, and 96 throw accuracy on the run. Those attributes are all ridiculously good. This is going to be the best quarterback in the game if you're comfortable throwing with a lefty, of course. There are people like me who just, that just doesn't come naturally. So I don't know if I'll ever end up utilizing this Mike Vick or what, but if I do potentially pull it, you will see some gameplay on the channel before I probably sell it, of course, because this thing's going to be expensive as hell. But, um, Again, guys, bottom line, this card is going to be absolutely crazy. This is, again, the boss edition. It's going to be in packs for 48 hours, so it's a little bit different uh, than some of the other ones that they've done this year, the limited editions. So we're definitely seeing a little bit of a difference there. Now, along with this version of Vic, there are also other editions of Vic that you're going to see on your screen right now. Just like last year, these are going. To, I'm assuming that these are the ones that are going to go into the set to build just the standard Ultimate Legend Mike Vic. You see that one there at the bottom, the 99 version. Um, so you're going to see five collectibles, it looks like. There's the 2006 year, the team collectible, and then three different versions of Vic. I'm assuming like a speed version, which is I think the top right one, maybe like a throw power one, something like that. I, I'm not exactly sure what they are. I'm sure they're actually probably pretty similar to the ones that they had last year. They might even be the same card art to some extent, maybe updated a little bit. But uh, So there you go. That is the set anyway. There is also something new that is coming into the game this year, and that is the Ultimate Legend Badges. Now, these are going to be something where you're going to need one of these, I'm assuming, to put into the set to actually complete your, uh, your Ultimate Legend. Now, I'm not exactly sure how these are going to be acquired. I'm presuming that you can possibly uh, buy them off of the market, but we don't know that for certain at this point. What we do know, though, from the EA blog is that you can actually build them. Now, what you need to build an Ultimate Legend badge is just three Legend badges. So, uh, the current ones, the blue ones, you'll need three of those. You'll get an Ultimate Legend badge in exchange. So, uh, that should make things at least decent um, as far as like being able to actually get those legend badges it shouldn't be too bad uh, but you will still obviously need one of those to build your ultimate legend players now in addition to the Mike Vick guys there's also a boss edition of Jason Taylor. I did not know about this one uh, earlier today when I reported the information. So this is definitely something cool. We're getting two boss cards. I don't know if that's going to be the case every single week or if it's just this first week. But it's nice to have two Ultimate Legends and two boss cards that are going to be added to the game this weekend. So there's definitely going to be some pretty beastly cards that you can potentially pull. I'm assuming that there's going to be some big bundles. I'm probably going to have to assume that we're going to see legend packs in the game. So that would give us more legend uh, badges and things like that. But yeah, I mean, these cards are really, really good. This card's got 92 speed along with 100 acceleration and 100 finesse move. So that is going to make it just a dominant, dominant defensive end. Insane for pass rushing, of course. Um, now, in addition to the Jason Taylor boss edition, of course, there is the standard Ultimate Legend version of his card as well. And that card is going to be really, really good as well. So you guys can see here on the screen, there are a bunch of different versions of older versions of him. There's, I think, a rookie card, maybe like a speed version, a power version. And so there you go. That That's going to be the cards that you need to actually build the set for Jason Taylor. Again, you should probably, I'm assuming you're going to need the, uh, the legend badge, the ultimate legend badge for every single set that you do here for the ultimate legends. 
But uh, there you go, guys. That is the update there. We've got two Ultimate Legends coming tomorrow. Jason Taylor, Mike Vick. Good luck pulling them. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Again, we'll give you the information regarding new Ultimate Legends as soon as we get them in the future. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, do me a favor. Click the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I'll talk to you guys again soon.